subscribe to RA Solutions by clicking on the subscribe button and clicking on the bell icon to receive notifications. Hello there, welcome to another video about RA Solutions. In this one, I'm going to show you how to loop a PowerPoint presentation. So let me just set the scene for you. You've got a presentation evening or a, an open evening or a specific event. You want to run a presentation evening. You want that presentation to advance the slides automatically and keep rolling the PowerPoint presentation over and over again without you having to step in until you press escape where it comes out of that presentation. So you're going to be adding a loop to this presentation and this is how you do it. So I've got a PowerPoint presentation opened up here. What I need to do first and foremost is one thing is um, set up the loop to my PowerPoint presentation. So the first thing you need to do at the top where you've got the ribbon underneath the uh, or above the font section here you've got the slideshow option click on slideshow um, just on and here in the the setup option you've got setup slideshow click on that option there and it will bring up this pop-up box here now in this pop-up box it's a simple case here under the show options option you check the box which says loop continuously until you press escape that one there so you click on that and you simply click on OK so let's just test this presentation as it is so if I start this presentation like this it will if I click on enter it will play the next slide as it should click on the next one which it should click on the next one which it should like this and it sh should keep rolling the presentation and it'll go back to the beginning which it has done and I'll keep pressing enter and you can see the animations obviously in the presentation which are fine and then it goes back to the middle the only way this presentation is going to stop looping is until I press escape so when I press escape it will end that PowerPoint presentation as exactly how I've attended it to be now another thing I want to do now I've, I've checked that box to say loop the presentation until you press escape but I want this presentation to play on its own so if I could just highlight the first slide again now this slide I want it to play for what five seconds so at the top where you see transitions um, in the tab here you see the transition tab click on transition tab scroll all the way to the right side and you can see the timing option here we're going to set timing uh, for each of the slides in the PowerPoint presentation so this first slide is I want this to play for five seconds so in the advanced slide option there's two options I'm going to uh, make sure the second one is also selected which is after so after five seconds it's going to advance that slide to the second slide now slides two three four and five um, I want each of those to be on for what 15 seconds each 10 let, let me say 10 seconds so the same thing applies second slide go to the transition option scroll to the right side where it says timings click on the after checkbox and this time move this up to 10 seconds do the same with slide 3 transitions after there is a quicker way of doing this but I'm just showing you step by step how to do this uh, in case you forget two three four five six seven eight nine ten and do the same for slide five transitions after ten seconds so after ten seconds it should advance the slide that's from slide two three four five then go back to the first slide and that first slide should be playing for five seconds let's see if this works go to slideshow at the top click on set um, slideshow from beginning start from beginning one two three four five and it's gone to the second slide without me having to touch anything one two three four five six seven eight nine ten it should stop I counted quick there there you go it's gone to the next one and you get the message it'll keep going um, even if I click on enter it will keep playing the slides 
and it will keep rolling that PowerPoint presentation going back to the start again and it will keep doing this until I come here and I interject manually and I press escape or I click on this end slideshow here. So I've clicked on escape, it's gone back here. So that's just a quick and easy video showing you how to loop um, your PowerPoint presentation continuously until you have to press escape and also how to add timings to each slide in that presentation. I hope this video has helped you. Please like, subscribe and share.